everyone, welcome back to another they food video. <laughs> <laughs> I'm keeping that in. I'm keeping that in. Welcome back to another food video. Today's video is Vaughn Rib Fest. So they travel around to different locations around Toronto and there's like a little carnival and most importantly, the ribs. I'll give you a little tour of what's going on around and I definitely will get some ribs. So let's see what they got. Okay, so it's not that big. Pretty much ends at the Ferris wheel there and it goes down to around that sign. So I'm gonna walk around and just show you guys what they got here. It's four dollars to get inside here and then you pay for whatever you want. Ribs or the carnival games. So they got the midway. They got the midway here. You can win a giant tiger if you want. Or like that lady said, a giant llama. So we gotta find a giant llama. They have a little train that takes you around for the kids. You can go really? Yeah. Wow. That's why. Oh. Apparently they're closing at uh, six, so we gotta go eat ribs right now because it's like six o'clock. There's the giant llama. If you cover the red one time, you win. Anything you want here, five dollars, ten dollars. The giant llama. Get the giant llama. We're in the actual rib area, so I'll give you a tour around here. Over there. Hey, what's up, Nick? Do they close at six or eleven? They close. They're closing. Okay, so let's eat something. Funnel cakes, some blooming onions, lemonade. You got the ribs over here. So, all these people are like basically in competition. So, who is the best one to have? But it looks like they are closing right now. Oh no, I thought they closed later. Which one should I get really quick? Here's all the trophies. So these guys want a lot of trophies. I know. You gotta hurry up and get something. Sticky fingers. Maybe look at all the trophies. Yeah, but that's all first place. Camp 31. They are, they're all showing off their trophies. This music is so loud. A full rack is $25. Half a rack is $16. Okay, I got the full rack of ribs. I got beans and coleslaw. And we got a pulled pork sandwich. The total came to $39. There was only like five racks of ribs left. So we came perfect time. Hopefully it tastes good. I wish we came earlier when like we can see the other places, but whatever. This should be good. It, it smells really good in here. The sauce smells amazing, but let's see how it tastes. The one thing I can guarantee this is gonna get messy, but right. that's okay. Let's try with let's try the beans first, some baked beans. Are they good? They're okay. Oh well, Matt, you got the full rack. The slam one, you know? Sixty dollar one? No, we got full rack of ribs, coleslaw and beans and pulled pork sandwich. It was uh dollars thirty nine dollars. There's no cornbread left. No. Okay, so here's the ribs. It looks nice and saucy. I'm not a huge fan of coleslaw, but nah. Don't care much about that. Let's try these ribs. Let's get messy. Yeah, it's really good. This is yours? It's the ribs. They're not as hot as I want them to be though. Oh, yeah, because you got mild. No. <coughs> not the sauce. When it comes to rib fest, I expect these ribs to be hot. amazing. You don't think they're amazing? I don't think it's amazing. I think they are. Ellis Island ribs are better. Was that Vegas? Yeah. Yeah, you can. That's Vegas. The thing with ribs, it's it's the sauce that makes it for sure. I expect no, it to not. like fall off the bone. Yeah. Like this is like it's all right. This is not a perfect rib. I'll tell you that. You think it's late? I'm still gonna finish it. I don't know. Maybe it's because it's late. I don't know. It's hard to say. How much better could they make it? Maybe we just picked the wrong one. That's smart, eh? We it's open. it's good, said six, man. but they they were open because they didn't sell out yet. Maybe everyone else sold out first because they were better. Mm. <laughs> oh, yeah, There's a few I looked over there. They didn't look as good the ribs. So this is the pulled pork. That's good. That needs more sauce. It needs more sauce. That's exactly yeah. what I was thinking. Ricky's hot sauce. Yeah, that the, the pulled pork is really good actually. Yeah, I like the. How much is all the sauce? This is okay. They should have drowned everything in sauce. Yeah, they should have double the sauce. 
So apparently these guys go from like town to town. Yeah. We're going to Pickering next week. Every weekend is somewhat different. Definitely the pulled pork wins here. That's cool. The Ellis Island? Better. What's this? The cream of Ellis Island is a whole rack of ribs, half a chicken, beans, coleslaw for $13.99. Wow. I'm not like a, a huge, huge rib fan. That's what we have right now. That was the only place I had. Well, I pretty much finished it all. I'm wondering now if uh, the other ones sold out first because they were better. And this was the only one that was left. I don't know. They all have these awards. They all have these different That's awards for different things. Closed, this one was closed. Because yeah. they sold out faster. They all say number one rib fest 2018. Yeah, 17. different years. They're all different locations. Stuff, but different areas. Different, different areas, yeah. I guess that's it. Do I have sauce on my face? Probably. I just ran into Maya and Leanne. I showed it to them. They had no idea who I am, but they saw me that's filming. Like, one. are you a vlogger? And I'm like, yeah. So they asked for a picture. So it was really nice to meet you. I hope you guys subscribe. Let me know. Comment if you actually subscribe. If you enjoyed this food video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. And I'll see you next time when we look for some more tasty food.